Still the book straight forward. Okay. So before the lesson, I want to ask you something. Just pause the video after the question so that you can answer. Okay. Are you ready? All right. Now, what time do you usually have breakfast? Okay. What did you have for dinner? And uh, where are you from? And try to spell your country. Okay. So after answering those questions, we will proceed with today's lesson uh, 7A. Okay. So the title of this chapter is Weekend City Break. All right, weekend city break. Do you remember weekend? Weekend is Saturday and Sunday. All right. So weekday is Monday to Friday. Weekend is Saturday and Sunday. Okay. So weekend city break. Now, if you have your books open, it would be great because you can actually see the answers and see the pictures. All right. So we're gonna try to study the vocabulary and try to review how to pronounce the words, okay? So let's start. Number one is a train station. Okay, a train station is letter I in your book, where the, where the train stops and the train leaves, okay? So, a train station, all right? Number two, a hotel. Okay, a hotel, of course, is a place where people Go overnight, relax, sleep, okay? So that is letter B, okay, in your book. A hotel, okay. Number three is a bridge, okay, a bridge, right. It connects two places, okay, two separate places. So it's called a bridge. The answer is letter F in your book, okay, a bridge. And number four is an airport. It's an because it's a vowel, right? So an airport. So an airport is for the planes, okay? For the airplanes. So the answer is letter D. You can see in the picture in your book. Okay. Next is a park. A park. That is letter A. Okay. That is where you take a walk, uh, try to exercise, walk your dog. Okay. That is a park. Okay. Next is a river. A river that is letter C in your book. So a river is uh, flowing water. Okay. So there's like a, a stream of water. Okay. That is a river. Okay. Next is a museum. Okay. A museum that is letter E. Okay. A museum is for history, for displays, all right? So for, for example, a uh, dinosaur museum. So those are bones of dinosaurs, okay? A museum, okay? Next is a castle, okay? Castle, we don't pronounce the T here, okay? So castle, all right? A castle, that is letter G in your book. So a castle, of course, is the big house of the kings, queens, prince, and pr uh, princess. Okay, so a castle. Next is a beach. Okay, remember it's a long e beach. Okay, a beach. So that is letter H. Of course, a beach is where you go sunbathing, swimming, okay, and relax, have fun, right? So let's review the pronunciation again. After I say the word, you can say it as well. Okay, ready, go. A train station, a hotel, a bridge, an airport, a park, a river, a museum, a castle, a beach. Okay, so we are going to proceed with the grammar. I'm going to erase this and we're going to proceed with a simple grammar. So grammar. So the same chapter, the grammar is actually, uh, yeah. All 
All right, so the grammar of uh, 7a week and city break is this one. There is and there are. Okay, so what is the difference? Is is only one, one thing. Are is two or more. Okay, two or more. For example, you say, there is a, because only one, remember, a or an, only one, there is a bus station, okay, there's a bus station, so only one bus station, okay, now, there are, the noun is two or more, so you can say, there are buses okay there are buses now that's actually the example in your can, can, we, can we repeat that <laughs> <laughs>